the rights that should have been down, like the rats of Tabrock, with the big sea. <laughs> How about that um, Korean man, a uh, South Korean man? John. John, how about that South Korean man? Oh, yeah, I'm sorry, he's on his own. Can't do anything. South Korean man. South Koreans are flying at a plane. Yeah, it's true. They've got a camp too. Huh? Uh, no. Yeah, can, yeah, can you... Who, who's that now? Uh, who's that? Yeah. 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 Uh, yeah. Yes, that's right. What's that? 23rd February. All the time I spent packing my suitcases over the last <laughs> and now it's here. It's a verity lesson in um, don't have material values. Yeah? <laughs> but I'd never take them up. Four years ago. So this was the final year. Slap, slap, goodbye. Anyone got a Labiana pie? Oh, oh the man yeah. Yeah. yeah, he's a very nice man, yeah. See, there are nice people around. They're as scared as we are, you know. <laughs> God, so. That was a magician. What time? Oh, Jan and Marcus uh, are on the same place. No, Marcus is gone. Uh, they've left on the early bus. Yes, but they're on the same flight as you. No. Was there only five and a half? What flight? You're on an African flight. I'm Italian. Uh, we got to Rome. You're going to Rome. Okay. Hello. 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 I mean, some, who was it that was saying, um, well, I think it was Bar Barbara was saying that um, this man she knew was gay. She should have told us to leave um, you know, when we had that day of school. She should have left uh, two days before that. <laughs> Good girl, you know. But we're on the way. No, they didn't tell us. Because they're bloody fools, that's why. Even the German embassy, uh, no, the Australian embassy, knew nothing. They have no idea what's happening, what to do, anything. So the best way to learn is to, you have to have some army training, and you have to depend on yourself. That's okay. the next do you see? Have what you've got. Do you see? When you were in the airport, you have trouble getting inside, you and Raymond would go in and try and find something about the camping about the Germans. Well,
Well, the lady said there are six people left at the German embassy and there should be an international camp set up around the airport. Well, we'll send Raymond in with you. Okay? Yeah, okay. Yep, fine. I'm, I'm Australian, but I'm German British uh, citizenship. Yeah. Mum and Dad are German English. <laughs> um, well, moved around quite a lot. Born in South Australia, lived in Queensland, but moved around quite a lot. The Queensland. How about you say? Okay. Oh, it doesn't sound like it, does it? Get out, mate. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. Yeah, even in my own you country, lived in people Britain think. For a while, or not? No, not at all. Never. Okay. <laughs> but you see, Australia is so multicultural, and as well, mum and dad always grew up, they both have accents. So on my Facebook page. You are? On my Facebook page. Yeah. My portrait uh, picture. And you call yourself Crocodile that day. Yeah. I call myself Crocodile Day. Because, uh, because my picture is me petting a crocodile. Oh, very nice. This croc croc is flying on the ground. <laughs> God. And I'm giving him a pat. That, that was a scary day. thing about all this flood that happened in Australia. Because the crocodiles would come all at the head of the river then. So our house is not far from the head of the river. They could be swim. They literally could be swimming around. The, the beach there, so do you not <laughs> so, all the, but isn't that strange, all of a sudden every country has a problem, China has this drought, um, New Zealand has an earthquake, this had protests, all the other country here, England and so, and even Canada had bad snow, this Iceland, the volcano was threatening to erupt again, for goodness sake, everything at once is happening, yeah? Okay. So even if we can hop to Malta, that's cool. Yep. Just let's get out. Never been there before, so that would be first for me anyway. <laughs> God. Good on her, yeah. Jodie Chaplin said the easiest tickets to buy are Malta and Tunisia. There's no traffic that's a good sign here. <laughs> Not a good sign. It is. Oh, yeah. <laughs> No, but good sign, I mean, when I went to the... But when I went to the airport the day before yesterday, we were stopped by a military block with all armed people. So that's why I'm saying a good sign, because there's no one stopping us. We stopped, there were ten people, they all had collision and cost. Just waiting, checking our cars, the boot, everything. So, well, I don't know, maybe it could still happen, so I don't know.
right now I'm on the school bus and uh, they've just got a confirmation uh, from the airport that their airplane is leaving. So uh, my, my phone, I've just lost the uh, all connectivity on my phone. So I you only just lost it now? If you, if you get anything around to change, just put a chart on it. You can just keep me posted as well. matter about tickets for tomorrow, just go check in. <laughs> just smile and who cares, yes? Yeah? Who? He's he gone out. When? He's he gone out. Okay, yeah. Oh, see. Africa, was he? I think he was flying Africa, yeah. So that's a good sign then for you. Just tell them, yeah, my tickets are now, today. Come back with that one or go with that one, do you? Yeah. No, 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 that's right. Yeah, man. Did you listen to the speech yesterday? A bit of it. It's a bit ridiculous. Couldn't even believe what he was saying. Did he know what he was saying? I think actually he looked a bit um, like he's going. Uh, yeah, a bit go going he is upstairs. Else he home, wouldn't look so mad, yeah. Fox Crash, yeah, here I come.
turn another turn then direct south. Didn't realise how strange it was. you know. Are we here already?
I mean, that's just a two-sided knife, isn't it? <laughs> Pardon? Yeah. I got my hat, see? G'day. when we stop. I can't look, I can't even move. Okay, we're here now, right. Okay, um, should we unload and then make a bit of a plan or Unload, unload and get to the airport, wait there. Oh, no, we're pushing up. Oh, okay. oh, I know, I mean, when we stop. Yeah. Yeah, he's still a good look. I'm just glad to be here, though. It's good. Oh, someone dropped something. Oh, the electricity kettle. So, GC and Dave, you've got... I have, I just, I can't move here. Yeah, I will give you, definitely. <laughs> Barbara? Just wait. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. Okay, I'll do it again. Yeah. In fact, I don't have a wallet in there. I can give it to somebody else. Please. But we absolutely have no time now. Oh, let me unpack it. <laughs> um, can I just have a show of hands how many people have got a, a ticket for somewhere? Yep. Uh, how many not, people not, have, not for today though. Yeah, not yeah. for today. How many people haven't got a ticket at all? I've got two. Plane <laughs> 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 left last night, but it might just get you into the car. Yeah, yeah, you yeah. never know, yeah. Okay. I've got KLM reservation for tomorrow, so but I haven't yeah. been able to get in to pay for it. Go and and those are the five tickets. Yeah. Those that need to buy tickets and those that want to change tickets. That, that makes sense. Well, that the, the people, once we get there, <laughs> might be splitting between the people oh, who have some wrong. form of ticket. And those of us who don't. Someone can work well in charge. Very, very good. Well, we have one good. from Malta on Friday. We're not sure which bloody airline it is. But yeah, just go, oh, those who want to change your mortgage, those who don't have a ticket go together, and those who have got tickets go together. Who doesn't have a ticket? It's me on my own. No. No, this is worse than that. Oh, yeah. Well, no, we haven't got a ticket. We've got a reservation. We've paid for it. We've got a ticket in the we can reiterate when we get off the bus to yeah, line up in three lines. <laughs> Where's your cap? Your cap here. <laughs> uh, and Raymond and Jesse are going to go and find if they, the German team. Well, two places I know check uh, is the checkout and the Lufthansa. Maybe someone from the embassy knows. <coughs> Already. Oh, one, one thing our lady did today was you must make contact with one of the people in the vest from the embassy out there. Yeah. Okay. So everybody, they did say you should make contact with an embassy person out here. And it doesn't matter. Yeah, it doesn't matter what, what which one they've got a vest on. Do we know where they are? Uh, Be careful. Some people vest a police. 
<laughs> but they're usually upstairs. <laughs> usually. We got an end. I'm going to catch a 6 o'clock bus so that we can get here and then like the other people getting in early in the morning because every time we've come as late as this we've never been able to get into the building Right have actually managed to get just sweep into the car park and today not even that is possible. Thank you can rest assured that you're paying probably one go on time. Wayne ended up waiting another six hours but at least he got he was gonna go back to the flat. I have a good feeling that today and tomorrow we'll be going, you know, so even if I have to stay here overnight, let's just get out. Yeah, bloody just stay. They know uh, the Brit uh, German embassy said there's an international camp where people are staying, where anyone from EU is welcome. And uh, I think, I don't know, you can sleep there? I don't know. As, uh, I, I know as much as you at the moment, except that there is one. <laughs> What's happening? Who was it? Graham. Uh, no, no. Ding, ding. Raymond. Raymond here. Raymond. I'll call you. Who was it? Uh, one of the Ellie Burton drivers. Obviously they've got guys here.